Guess what? It's another beautiful day here in Brooklyn, New York. I'm outside once again. It's not as sunny as yesterday, but it's still very nice. And I have even better news. That's right. It's after 4 o'clock. The markets are closed. It's officially the weekend. And it's happy hour in the Big Apple. Now U.S. stocks, they continue their record climb Friday afternoon, this time with both the Dow and the S&P touching fresh new highs. This after the main jobs report showed slow but steady improvement. Now monthly data had non-farm payrolls rising 217,000 and the jobless rate unchanged 6.3%, therefore leading the Dow to jump to an intraday record and last up half a percent. The S&P 500 also hitting an all-time high, recently up 0.4% to just below 1950 with industrials the best performer and the nasdaq adding 0.5 percent as well now for every share falling roughly three rows over the new york stock exchange and let's now take a look to see how the markets not only closed today's trading session but the week as well The only major focus in terms of the corporate front was Sprint, as its shares fell as it reportedly closes in on a deal to acquire T-Mobile USA. And there you have it. Kick back, relax. It's looking to be a beautiful weekend here in a tri-state area. Go to the beach, do something, picnic. And I'll see you guys all Monday morning. From MonoWallStreet.com, I'm James Swinney. It's another beautiful day here in Brooklyn, New York. I'm